And I'm going to show you quickly how that works. It's important that you understand it because remember, we're going to move away from a trillion dollar market cap. When Bitcoin creates 2.1 trillion market cap when it hits 100,000, most coins are going to be in half a billion, trillion, two trillion. And put a thousand trillions together and you've got a quadrillion. Can you see where this is going? The name trillion, when we look at how much money is in the world stock markets, we talk about, hey, there's trillions of dollars. BlackRock owns trillions. Guys, forget it. Wipe that out of your memory. Cryptocurrencies are heading to quadrillion. And when they go past quadrillion, they can even go into quintillion. And the way that you work this out, for example, uh, I just want to refresh your memory if you were in school. To work this out, let's say to put down a million dollars works like this. Okay, so there you go. That is one million. Million is called M-I-L, me, single. So you get your thousand, but when you add one single digit of three th of zero, zero, zero to it, you get a million. The next set downwards, if you take that now down and you put one, two, three, one, two, three, that's a million, one, two, three. Now what you have is you've got a billion. What is that? That is called billion. You've got three zeros there. You've got three zeros there. You've got one zero there. Can you see by? By means two. So that's how you can easily distinguish between two zeros. You're going to need this, trust me, because as the market gets bigger, you're not going to understand these, these very big numbers like trillion and quadrillion. Now, the way that you figure out what is after a billion, it's a trillion. Now, remember, you get your one, two, three zeros. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. That is a trillion. Okay, try. Trillion. Try in Latin, trillion, three. So that means three. Okay, so what has happened here now is that you have one, two, three lots of zeros after the 1,000. Where this market is going to move into is going to be in the next set, which is quadrillion. You look at one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, another one. Now, that is called quad. Quad is the Latin word for four, you know, quad, like a quad bike with four wheels. And when you look at that, you're going to go, this is one, that's two, three, four. And that's how you get to four. Now, this is soon, very soon, I reckon within about 18 to 24 months, People are going to start talking not about trillion, but about quadrillion. So that's going to be called, become the norm for people to talk about, hey, the crypto market is going to go to quadrillion. Now, the crypto market is going to go to quadrillion before the world stock markets does. And then the world stock markets, everybody in the world, in the New York Stock Exchange worldwide, they're going to start figuring out, wait a second, I can take my Apple shares and I can create an NFT like per share. And that NFT like per share that's attached to it, I can go and sell that for $1,000. You know what's going to happen then? The world is going to start moving into the next phase, which is now called quintillion. Quintillion is the Latin name, also the French name for quint, quint, you know, which means number five. So the way that you get there is going to be one, two, three, 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 and then another one. Okay, and this will be, it's called quintillion. Um, I think you spell it something like that. Quintillion, which actually means, which is the name five. Okay, five by. So that means that you have five, three zeros next to that. So that gives you one, two, three, four, five. We're not going to go further than quintillion in our lifetime. I can tell you that because after quintillion, what happens is you've got sextillion. And then what happens is it goes all the way down to uh, Google, not Google, but Google, which is about a hundred zeros. Um, if I'm not mistaken, a hundred zeros. And then before that, you, before that, you get the zillion, I think. The zillion is basically 33 zeros. But if you now can start enlarge your thinking by thinking about this here for a second, we in the billion dollar market cap. And I'm going to show you now with my algorithm data where people are going to miss the gate. There's a specific gate in cryptocurrencies. If you miss that gate, 
your gains will be very, very limited. Most of the gains are going to be made